Hi, I'm Michael Hush, Head of Quantum Science and Engineering here at QControl. We've released some great new features in Boulder Opal, including a whole new module specifically targeted at multi-qubit cold iron gates. Let's have a quick look at the new features that are now available to all of our users. First, we've released a major update to our simulation package that includes realistic noisy dynamics. You can now represent your quantum system using the same flexible graph-based approach as in our optimizer module. This means you can include nonlinear scaling of control amplitudes or time-dependent modulations on signals appearing in your Hamiltonian. Furthermore, you can simulate quantum systems with dynamics directly reflecting linear filters used to capture the distortions arising from transmission line band limits. We also allow you to choose the information returned by a simulation. For instance, you can choose to retrieve only the average quantum state. This allows you to simulate much larger systems without accumulating an excess amount of data. Of course, if you'd like to troubleshoot, access to all trajectories and unitaries is still available. These major updates to the simulation package make validating control performance in realistic environments even easier. Filter functions are a convenient tool we've developed that permit you to understand the noise susceptibility of an arbitrary control. With our latest update, we now give the option to return not just the overall noise susceptibility of a control, but also to include a calculation of the noise operator in the control frame as a function of frequency. This significantly expands the utility of the noise spectroscopy features in Boulder Opal, giving you insight into exactly how noise impacts different parts of your quantum system's state. With this feature, you can now isolate the signature of a noise in a specific direction, permitting new forms of noise spectroscopy. Our application note on using provably optimal band-limited Slepian functions to sense a dephasing noise process reveals how powerful this can be when a noise process impacts your system in a complex way. Finally, we're happy to release a new module enabling the creation of error-robust entangling gates for trapped ions based on the well-known mormon sorensen interaction. This technique uses a special bichromatic laser field in order to engineer an effective coupling between ions through their shared Coulomb repulsion. Our new feature set allows you to create new forms of error-robust mormon sorensen gates by a time domain modulation of the amplitude and phase of this bichromatic field. Our flexible toolkit allows you to create modulations for these lasers that can create any pairwise entangling gates, all-to-all -all entangling gates, or any combination of many-to-many -many entangling gates with arbitrary entangling phases all in parallel. You can choose optimal solutions, which ensure target entangling operations are achieved while ensuring all modes of motion are decoupled, or you can add robustness to trap instabilities, giving you gates that yield high fidelities even in the presence of laser or trap frequency fluctuations. Examples in our user guides include registers of up to 10 ions, but larger systems are easily handled. To learn more, you can read about these gates in our recent paper appearing as a cover article for Advanced Quantum Technologies, or our experimental demonstration in Physical Review Applied. That concludes this month's updates. We have more specialized modules coming soon to further enhance our support of neutral atom quantum computing systems. So stay tuned for more updates from QControl and go to app.qcontrol.com to get started with Boulder Opal today.